Hey, what's going on guys? Hope everything's going well. So I got about five minutes. I wanted to just shoot a quick video. I'm getting ready to get out of my hotel, move on somewhere else. So I just wanted to quick, uh, shoot a quick video about how to rank in the Google three pack using reviews. And it's going to be super simple, very easy to understand, but this is going to be quick. So you may have to watch this more than once. I don't have a, I don't have a lot of time. Once again, this, uh, video is dedicated to my best friend who passed away darren marion on november 14th 2021 guys if you haven't gotten a ct uh cardiac uh prescription from your primary care doctor please get that it could predict a heart attack up until 15 years so with that being said let's get started All right, guys, so I already have everything loaded up in the interest of time. I did a search that was something like pressure washer. You can use any keyword. I'm just showing you how to get in the Google three pack if this is you. I want you to type in the keyword. So, for example, in this case, I'm using the word pressure washer, right? And if you're somewhere on the first page in the Google three pack, right? If you're somewhere in the first page, what I'd like you to do is I would like you to just find your listing. I already have one loaded. I took a look at uh, Logo Pressure Washing, right? So this is about 7th or 8th, but it could be, you know, it could be uh, uh, 10th, 11th, 12th place. It's okay. It's just going to take a little longer. So this is what I want you to do. The first thing I want you to do, step one, and I'll usually, I usually put step one, but I don't have time to do that. So this, write this down. It's just step one. Step one, what I'd like you to do, and I hope I'm not making you nauseous, is I'd like you to go through other people's reviews. And I'd like you to start pulling out. You could write the keywords down, right? I want you to start looking at all the keywords right here. People often mention and write all these keywords down. Then I want you to go through some of the reviews and see if anything see if anything is sticking out in regards to any kind of trust words anything that's trust for example professional i would take as a trust word informative i would take as a trust word right hard working i was taking as a trust. i would write all these down put them in excel spreadsheet whatever you want to do just get these words down and i want you to go through the top three or four people I want you to go through, don't use it a business like uh, like Lowe's or Home Depot or national brands, right? Use use some mom and pop. So there's McCreary pressure washer. If he was to add the word uh, Largo to it, he'd probably be on the first page, but I don't suggest you do that. You could get, you could also get uh, suspended. Okay, so I go through here, find most relevant. He doesn't, he may not have enough reviews for most relevant. Okay, here's another one professionalism, quality, responsiveness, value, right? So I would write all those keywords down. So that's step one. Get all those keywords, trust keywords, write them down. And anything that sticks out in your industry, you're like, okay, that's good. That's good. So if we're speaking about pressure washer, maybe we're using the word power washer. Maybe we're using the word soap. Maybe we're using the word detergent, right? All those have to do with pressure washer. You get the idea. If you're a DUI lawyer or you're a plastic surgeon, right? Whatever your thing is, you write down your keywords and write down your trust words. Trust words and keywords. Write them down. All right. We got that. Now, we're going to go to the website. And we're going to go to his pressure washing page. His pressure washing page appears to be his um, his pressure washing page appears to be his home page. That's his pressure washing page. I want you to take the first 500 words, meaning this, this. I want you to take the first 500 words. Probably, probably goes down to about here. And I want you to sprinkle in some of those words that you just wrote down. Sprinkle in. So instead of over 20, 20 years of experience, 
you know, what were some of the the, the uh, keywords that, that they said quality and they said uh, professionalism, right? Just take out, you know, over 20 years of, of uh, over 20, 20 years of professionalism in pressure washing located in uh, Lago or uh, top rated Google professional pressure washer in Lago, right? Just change that. Sprinkle in those keywords. Sprinkle them in because we need this site to be crawled again by Google. So we need to change the first 500 words. Sprinkle in those keywords, the trust keywords and the keywords that you found in the reviews. I hope you guys are following me because I am whipping through this, all right? So I'm just going to say it again. Find the re find, Go through other people's reviews. Find find the um the keywords and the and the um you know the the, the 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 words that that have to do with you know with quality the trust the trust words write them down add them to that page that uh that you're trying to rank it may be one of your inside pages right it may be your home page in this case it's the home page that's what ranks this is the pressure washing page in your case, it may be one of these pages, your keyword pages. All right, it may be one of the keyword pages. All right, now to the next thing. Go to your post and create posts using those keywords, those trust words, and make sure you make all the posts about pressure washing using those keywords, those trust words. Create posts using the same words the words that you got from the reviews the words you added you added to that specific page you're going to create over the next two three weeks three posts a week on pressure washing just on that keyword because what we're trying to do is we're trying to get to the first place so what we're doing is we're we're changing the words on the page. In this case, it's the home page, but it could be your, in your case, could be the inside pages. Then you're going, you're creating some Google posts on that keyword, pressure washing, DUI, electrical engineer, whatever you do. And then the third thing, you're coming back to reviews. You have all those keywords written down. And all those and all, and all those um, uh, those trust words. You, if you're in this area, let's just say this is you. You want to look look through your customer list, and you need reviews from people in this area. Not from. Not from here. Not from New Mexico. Not from Haiti. Not from Miranda, Merida, Merida, not from Cancun, from here. Okay? This is where you need your reviews from. You need them from this little area, wherever your area is. If you're in Alabama, you're in Chicago, you're in California, you need them from this area. This is where you need your reviews. So, we're just going to review one more time. Listen, I'm sorry that I review so many times, but I want to make sure that everybody got it. If everybody, if you got it at this point, I'm just going to say the same thing over and over. I guess you could just X out. Make sure you subscribe. Okay? So you're going to, as a recap, as a recap, you are going to find reviews, go through the reviews, find trust words and keywords for the keyword that you're trying to rank. In this case, it's pressure washing pressure washer. In this case, it's pressure washer. Find the page on your website that speaks about pressure washing. In this case, it's the home page. Yours, it may be the one of the inside pages. Fix the first 500 words. Add the, sprinkle in all those key terms on that page. Only on the first 500. Next, create posts using those trust words and those keywords. Next, get reviews using those trust words and those keywords about pressure washing. I don't like to guarantee anything, but I guarantee you, you're gonna move up in the ranking. Now, one of the other things I want you to do, 
for example. And I'm just using this as an example. Hey, everybody, Larry. I like this guy, Larry Lawton. He speaks, if you guys don't know, I worked in jail for 20 years. He speaks a lot of things about jail. I don't know why I still like it, but okay. So in your description, create a YouTube video about pressure washing. Add those keywords in here with the link going back to that page. Right? So you led, you know, you led that, you led your website slash pressure washer if, if it's an inside page. If it's the home page, it's just ABC pressure washer. If it's uh, ABC services slash pressure washer, you want to add the page that's, that, that, that uh, you created a keyword page for. Could be the home page, could be the inside page. Every case is different. You have to know that. But put that specific link in, in a YouTube video because that'll help uh, crawl. Uh, YouTube um, is owned by Google and Google will crawl the page faster. Right? So create a video about pressure washing, put all the keywords in here, make a nice little sentence, have it written out really nice and create a link going back to your website to that specific page. Guys, did I do it? Did I do it? I hope I helped everyone out. And uh, most important thing out of this whole video is make sure you take care of your health, get that cardiac CT scan, and um, please take care of your family. Please, that's really, really important. Kiss your wife, kiss your kids, be appreciative of, your, appreciative of your family. That's really the most important thing. If you've watched this far, I want you to know that this is going to be your year that you're going to make it. I guarantee you it's going to work out. It's going to start to work out. You're going to start to see a light at the end of the tunnel. Just keep on doing what you're doing, man. Keep on doing. Keep on working. Keep on watching videos. Keep making tweaks. You could do it. You could do it. I promise you. And we'll catch you up on the top of the hill. All right? Take care, guys. Bye.